Hello world, I'm someone else. Welcome back to Mad Games Tycoon. Last time we got uh, this game out, How to Train Your Lizard 2, which is actually How to Train Your Lizard 2 2, because uh, <laughs> I named it really, really shitty. Um, it is selling amazing, this game. Uh, nearly half a million copies per, per week, and we are making an, an update for it. Um, I think we do want to make a marketing campaign for it as well. Um, yeah, and we started training 16 guys down here for um, our main development department that is uh, progressing as uh, planned. Right now they are out of courses for the year, unfortunately. Um, so they will have to wait a little bit until they can continue training. But we just started um, development on Sad Horse Hunter. Uh, uh, first person shooter uh, horse hunting game. So that will be interesting to see how that goes. Uh, it is the first uh, first person shooter we try to make, so yeah. I have no idea if it uh, how it will go, but oh, that wasn't uh, didn't want to pause. I wanted to speed up a bit. Uh, let's see, new year started, so let's hope we can get going again. Uh, that guy up there was learning game design, I believe. So we give these guys the programming course. Um, yeah. This guy up here is the last guy we need to train for quality assurance, and then that will be that department will be maxed out. So yeah, we are slowly getting towards maximum capacity. F um, yeah, as soon as that is done, then we will train some. Yeah. Actually, we are probably not going to train anyone for this department down here. I think we're just going to take um, some programmers from over here, because it will just be a temporary job when we start developing our our successor to the A-Box. Uh, we need to market the game we are developing. Sad Horse Hunter. I am sure it will be the most amazing game ever. Let's just bring the hype up to max. Uh, and I think we want to do one contract. Uh, and then we want to do an update for how to train your lizard too, to keep the sales up. Do we have some research? Nope. Uh, yeah, get on with it. Didn't I? Oh, I didn't repeat it. As usual. Yeah, let's have a look here at uh, development. Yeah, that is looking really good, really good. Let's speed things up and get these guys to develop the game update. Yeah, 1.4 million. That is uh, definitely worth it, I think. And we got 2.2 million. Not that it really matters. We have uh, nearly nearly 1.2 billion dollars saved up. Uh, so yeah, money is uh, not really an issue. Uh, make one more update right away. While it is still worth it. Um, yeah, these uh, things are going really good. to market anything? No, not really. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, 
is it worth it with uh, one more update, I wonder? We are earning about one and a half million per week from it. So I suppose if it can keep sales up for an extra week, yeah. I think it's gonna be uh, the last one. And these guys are done with the uh, let's give them game design. Let them use uh, one of the courses. And these guys are already done. Um, with the improving the gameplay. Yeah, already done. So they should just start working on the box. Yeah, and these are guys are almost done. Yeah, and the game is halfway done, more or less. Um, yeah, so when these guys, uh, when this department is filled out, I'm pretty sure um, all these things will be finished pretty much uh, same time. Got a million there. I'll take it. Uh, yeah, we don't want to make any more uh, updates now. Uh, we just want to work on contracts again, down here. And trend is going up down for that one. one. Uh, the hype for our next game is at max, so... Let's hype the A box before releasing the game. Let's get it to max. Any research we have? Oh, that was from here, right? Yeah. Um, let's see, we do have a feature, engine feature. Let's research that. And we had a new console thing as well. Let's have a middle booth to show off our two games and our A box. So, probably could have saved the marketing campaign for the A box, but. Oh well. Okay, fine. Let's see. Uh, we don't have any more box. We are just waiting for development to finish on on the game. Do we have any new stuff here? I wonder. No. Oh, these guys are finished again. Let's have a look at this guy's guy. He is finally maxed out. Let's get him uh, over here. So that department is uh, maxed out as well. Uh, you guys start training sound effects. And let's see how that progress is doing. That wasn't what I wanted to do, sorry. Uh, yeah, they are getting there on game design at least, and programming is... Yeah, they need a lot of that. Graphics? Decent. And music and sound. Yeah, they are definitely uh, getting there. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna leave this um, training room for now. Um, because uh, we are gonna delete this uh, big one later to make room for uh, some of the rooms we haven't looked into yet. Um, but we still do want to have a training room. And 
we had some console research we wanted to do down here. Uh, eight core chipset. <laughs> this next uh, console is gonna be quite the the step up uh, compared to the original A box. And yeah, it will be so awesome when we get uh, the new guys up here. How to train your lizard too is almost off the market. But it made 114 million dollars so far. And yeah, all looking good. You know what, this guy down here, I'm gonna fire you. Yeah. Goodbye. No need to pay for a guy sitting there when we are gonna take the guys from up here to develop the console. Okay, your programmers got the actual SDK, the software development kit. Therefore, some technical issues are resolved. Oh, plus 400 to uh, technology. That is cool. I haven't seen that um, pop up before. Um, let's pause for a second. Hype is still at max. Anything new there? No. Uh, yeah, not really anything to do except uh, finishing this game. I think it will be records except in uh, technology. Or will it? No. And uh, yeah, we want to publish it. We have 12 weeks left in the trend. Oh, technology was uh, max score and graphics. No, gameplay. Uh, graphics and sound are not the best we've made. Oh, did I see bugs? I did. That was stupid. Oh well, we will release a patch for it uh, immediately. Let's see, first person shooter. We have two. And the same market strength and same share. So let's just pick this one. Okay, same genre. We do have uh, two other games to compete with and one game in the with the same theme. So let's see. Uh, not the best. The game is highly recommended though. Uh, graphics, I suppose, could have been better. And sound could have uh, been better as well. But uh, yeah, it's uh, fine for a uh, first, first uh, person shooter, I think. I'm fine with that. Um, let's pause because we want to get, uh, get that uh, update out right away. The patch. So stupid to release a game with, uh, with bugs. That was... Unfortunate. Uh, do we want to do anything else? Uh, I think we want to stop the contract work down here and work on updates for this and uh, then the guys in the big department can uh, get rid of all these uh, contracts we have 15 at the moment yeah we are gonna pay that penalty I don't mind and get some update updates going for 
said Horse Hunter. It sold 700,000 copies in the first week. So that is pretty amazing. And these guys need to continue their training. Yeah. Okay, that was quick to get the box out of the way. Uh, yeah, let's get contracts out of the way. Yeah, look at the speed they uh, are doing doing these contracts. That is awesome. Um, you guys down here make the game report because I want to see how well we hit the, the settings for that game. We only got Studio of the Year. Yeah, it, w it wasn't the best uh, game we've made ever, so I'm fine with that. And they got the first update out. Um, yeah, let's get another one out right away. We are not gonna start development on a new game until we have the um, the next trend up. Okay. And I think we are just gonna... Ah, let's have them improve an engine. Uh, this one is the worst we have. Yeah. Let's do that. And as soon as that is done, they make another update. And here we go. Still selling uh, 600,000 copies per per week, and our contracts are getting there quickly. Okay, let's see simulation. We did make one of those, and we do have a decent engine for it. Uh, let's see there. My games, I want to see the review. Uh, yeah, simulation that was Ugly Joe's Conquest. Yeah, Vikings and Conquest and uh, simulation, real time strategy. Yeah, so we are probably not gonna make a successor to this one. Or we could make it um, <laughs> a Viking dating game. I don't know. Um, we want to see the game report for it though. Let's have a look. Uh, I do want to see Sad Horse Hunter as well. Oh, we hit it really good. Except these uh, priorities, those uh, were set horribly. But uh, yeah, that taken into consideration, I am very happy with... Uh, what was it? 83% game? Yeah, that is uh, quite awesome, I think. Let's have a look at this. Uh, the only one we missed was uh, game depth. Um, yeah. I wonder if it should have been higher or lower. Do we have any fan? Fan letters on that game. I wonder. Fan letters. Oh, we do. Ugly Joe's Conquest. 
sold extremely well. Okay, I knew that. Um, very well. We only have 48 weeks to get this done. So... I'm gonna stop working on the contracts. Uh, I believe we have a couple of updates for for the engine uh, simulation. Yeah, we have one feature. Stereoscopic 3D. Hmm. Yeah, let's just do it. It shouldn't take too long. One week, I think. Yeah. And... You guys get working on... One more update, because this game is still selling amazing. Uh, I want to see how close these guys are. We have some maxed out. That in programming, okay. Uh, that is going, going good. So let's get the successor going for Oclidios Conquest. Yeah, simulation, we are not gonna go with real-time strategy, I think. Mm, simulation and RPG, maybe? I wonder if that could be a good uh, A good combination. Playing first person shooter, third person shooter. You know what? Let's uh, let's do. Something like a conquest and dating. I know we don't have to pick um, both of them every time. I uh, it's I just uh, think it makes some some funny combinations. So. Um, yeah, we're not gonna make it a uh, real-time strategy. Uh, let's make it third-person shooter. Third-person uh, simulator on Viking dating. Ugly jo Joe's dating war. Yeah. And it should be the simulation engine we just updated, and... Wasn't Darkly Joe, uh, on a license? It no, it probably wasn't. Failures. <laughs> uh, Independence Friday. Sourgate SG1. Amazing. And... Hacker Slash. You know what? We gotta take that. Um, and I'm gonna grab Falians. And Sourgate SG1 as well. Uh, I don't want anyone else using those. Those are mine. 
Uh, yeah, let's use this. We don't want to replace uh, the name. All good, I think it is. Uh, wait a minute, we did have... Um, yeah, 4.9. Let's see, we did have some new uh, stuff on the market, I think. Uh, the Nintendo FIU. 1% marked, yeah, we are not gonna bother with that. A box, PC, and the upper mark is uh, Should we go for the newer ones? No, we are gonna go after the biggest possible marks, yeah. Excellent. Uh, we did have a concept for this one. Yeah. No, wait. We wanted the per perfect. These settings copied. And it was the game depth that was a bit off. Wonder if it should just have been a bit more beginner friendly. Let's just try and drop it down one notch and see what uh, that does. No new cup protection, so we take the best one, of course. And on this is uh, should be perfect. All features, excellent. And. Get all this nonsense going. Oh, improve graphics, everything. Improve the gameplay and everything, excellent. And we want to... Do we have research? No, uh, yeah, Th this one, get that. Done and just hype it. Uh, wait a minute, how is uh, that game doing? It is still at 100. Probably not worth it um, hyping this or the A box, so let's just. Um, get max hype on our next game. And they are working on that, yes, yes. Let's see. Yeah, let's just get going on this. Um, so that will be interesting to see how that does. These guys, let's see the sales. Sad horse on that, still doing amazing. Let's get another update out for it. Yes. 1.3 million, that is not too bad. Okay, 3 million there, I'll take it. But, uh, Oh, some new platforms and stuff, and did I see some research? I did. Excellent, let's get that. Seventh generation controllers. But uh, yeah, this episode is uh, about half an hour already, so um, we are gonna wait until next time with the uh, uh, finishing of this game and release. Um, yeah, I have high hopes for that game. I think it will... Um, it might end up being our best so far if we got that last setting right. But uh, we will see. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a comment or a like down below. And don't forget to subscribe if you don't want to miss the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.